Hi there, students. Adhocracy. An adhocracy. Okay, this comes from the phrase ad hoc. Ad hoc means um, made for a particular purpose, not planned before it happened. Um, so, to deal with problems on an ad hoc basis. But an ad hocracy, or ad hocism as well, is, um, a, is a management structure where the business deals with the problems as they um, appear. They don't, the management don't plan to avoid problems. They um, deal with problems as they appear. So there is this perhaps a balance, you need a balance between bureaucracy and ad hocracy. Bureaucracy uh, says you mu in this situation you must do this. And also that with a bureaucracy you have hierarchy. Whereas in an ad hocracy, um, the person who is closest to a problem uh, is the person who has the permission to deal with the problem, to solve this problem as they see fit. Because you can have a very rigid bureaucratic uh, company where the responsibility of each thing is defined, is uh, given to a specific person. And the way to deal with something, with, with any problem, with any situation, is strictly defined. You've got to go through the um, schedule or the, the, the list of things of how to do it. But in ad, an adhocracy, you're always adapting your methods, adapting the, the, your solutions to the exact problem that um, you have. This is a method of decentralized leadership. Um, the, the person who finds a problem deals with it. This is individual initiative. Um, this is organic mm, decision making. You're not using a rigid system of authority, a rigid system of uh, procedures. And it's the, it is the opposite of, of bureaucracy and hierarchy. Okay, so um, a, an ad hocracy culture. Now, ad hocracy is good, but there are clearly dangers with ad hocracy as well is that um, a, a, a problem may have a good standard solution and other solutions don't work. Um, although in an ad hocracy if you're, you've got a problem to deal with you can research into it and you find the best solution for it. So this is a, it's a way of doing business. You can have various different uh, cultures within a company and an ad hocracy culture is one of them. You could have a clan culture where people collaborate or a hierarchy where the uh, people control each other or a market culture where um, you, you compete, you compete with the op opposition to do it better. Um, but this is an ad hocracy and this comes from the word ad hoc. Um, okay, it's a temporary uh, organization or a temporary system to accomplish each specific task that the business needs. Um, you, you don't have to work out a system for e each and every uh, situation. It's, it's um, completely decentralized. Notice as well, there's this word ad hocism. Uh, is reacting to what happens or what's needed at a particular moment rather than trying to plan in advance because if you plan in advance very often um, you, you try and fix that fit that plan to what the what, whatever happens whereas in the ad hocracy you, you are much 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 more flexible it's a much more flexible style 
um, creative people are much more likely to do well in an adhocracy than a bureaucracy. Um, people who find cre creative solutions. Um, I think also a bureaucracy is very is very rigid and it kills spontaneity and things like that. Okay, so an ad hocracy. Um, you 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 take responsibility for the situation. Each person ha has to um, has to deal with the things that come to them that that that, that they see. So formality. Mm. An ad hocracy. I think I'm going to give it a six in formality. Using the semi-formal conversation, semi-formal or formal writing. This is very definitely a business word. And let's see, as to origin, it was coined by an American organ, organ, organizational consultant called Warren Bennis. Uh, and this was... Mm, coined, I think, in 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 the in the mid sixties. So, ad hocracy, um, a flexible system where you respond to the needs of the business. Enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you soon. Bye for now. Ad hocracy. <laughs>